There was no mention of a Super Bowl countdown clock this time. In fact, there was no mention of the Giants and Super Bowl in the same sentence at all. But even though Jerry Reese was a little less bold than he was a year ago in his first press conference of training camp, he made it clear that even after last year's 7-9 disaster, his expectations for this team are still pretty high. It's the National Football League, guys. It's, it's pressure. You know, it's a high-performance business. You can win the Super Bowl and the pressure's still there. It, you know, it, it, you have to come out. You have to perform high. And uh, it's no different from any other season. You know, we, we have high, high expectation. We expect people to perform high. And... Uh, you know, that's just the way it is in this business. There's a good reason why Jerry Reese still has high expectations for these Giants. It's because of his faith in Eli Manning and the strong belief that he can still be elite even after his miserable season last year. Except for him to, to, to bounce back and, and, and be the Pro, Pro Bowl caliber football player that we know he can be. You know, he, he's still a, a young football player, all things considered, you know, with respect to the quarterback position. So we expect him to, to come back and, uh, and be a leader and, and bounce back and... Uh, not have uh, some of the, the things that happened to him last year and, uh, you know, be a dynamic football player for us. Reese said that even at 33 years old, he still considers Eli Manning to be a pretty young quarterback, an indication that he thinks he has quite a few more good years left in his NFL career. And even though the Giants aren't quite ready to start talking contract with Manning yet, they do plan to do so eventually because they expect him to be their quarterback for many years to come.